hi everyone welcome back to my youtube channel in today's video we will do the installation and we are going to follow all the step which i explained in last video so right now in front of you you have these five steps so this is what we are going to start so the first step is install react router so what we are going to do is npm i react router tom so this is what we are going to install now if you will go to your packages and you will see react router 6.22 is installed so our react router is installed right now if you will look at the code status how our application is looking you can see what we want to do is we want to add this navigation so the next step is to add the uh, navigation component in our components folder so we will go to the, our components folder and we are going to create navigation dot jsx what i will do is i will just copy paste and go here and do navigation navigation i don't need all these props i can get rid of this also i can get rid of this i will be using nav because i want a link so in our web applications whenever you want a link you use uh, hash so this would be home and I want about contact about and contact my navigation is ready now I will import this in our header okay so first thing I will do is I will make it like this my Rick and Morty should be in an H1 and then I will import navigation I will have it here perfect now let's go and see how it is looking the CSS is off so let's fix it it should be flex and it should be just g5 between let's go and see yep now let's work on the font size and the spacing so i can have class name text large and padding 2 i think this is fine let me see how it is looking is i'm not sure if the font size is getting implemented no it is not so let me do one thing text i think it's lg i was actually trying to open react JS application yeah this is now it's better lg so let's go here copy and let's go back and you can see this is looking fine so our header is here navigation is here next step is create pages so we will go to the source create a folder pages in this i'm going to add about gsx and also i'm going to add contact.gsx so these are the two pages which we are going to create now what i'm going to do is i will copy this i know someone told me in one of my video that why don't you use the script of uh, generating these components i know i will use it promise but as of now let me do it like this but thank you for giving me such amazing feedback uh, i also learn every day something new from you folks okay so contact 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 and here if you will see we don't need that bracket with return uh, let me show you can you see this bracket is coming because i am returning only one uh, only one element uh, when you do format it will optimize by itself okay so this is also a good tip for you folks so okay let's go back so pages is done now let's go to the layouts so we are going to again come create layouts in this we are going to name root i can have uppercase also so there is no problem root layout gsx now what root is gonna have it is gonna have our header and footer so what we are going, going to do is let me just copy our about come to root layout and say root layout is the name here and now here we are going to import import header and then similarly we are going to do import footer from footer and then we can get rid of this add section we can have header here and we will have footer here 
Now, how our page content will come between header and footer. This is what we are going to learn in our upcoming videos. But right now we are just preparing our code for everything. So our root layout is done. Um, what is the next thing what we are going to do? Let's go back. We need to add routes. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to add here a folder routes. And in this we are going to have app routes.jsx. Now this is where our whole logic will be. This is where we are going to create our router, routes, router, everything will happen from here. So this is going to be our brain of uh, routing. And we are going to learn in our next video that how we can build this app routes, how it will use all our pages, our layout, and how the read, uh, routing will happen. So please keep watching this series. In the next video, we are going to move ahead and implement our routes. I will see you in the next video and the same request. If you like this video, please show your love by sharing in your network with your friends, in your office, in your college. If you have any feedback, please let me know in the comment section. I'm looking, looking forward for it. Thank you. Take care. See you in the next video.